Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying the new Snack Factory dessert thins. I have the chocolate chip. And I have brown. These were $2.98 a bag at Walmart. And uh, this one was hidden on the very top shelf and that this one was actually displayed. So I'm glad I even saw these. And Kevin went to their website and he tried to see if there were other varieties. Couldn't find them. And he couldn't find them at all. Couldn't even find on the, the website. option for them. Yeah, and he went to the website, uh, snackfactory.com, yeah. and they weren't on there yet. So Somebody um, didn't get the memo they had something new. Yeah, so we're just going to go for it. Um, it says dessert thins are the perfect indulgence straight from the bag or try dipping them into ice cream or sorbet top them with jam or nut butter be creative only 120 calories per serving that's four biscuits okay so we're just gonna try them straight out of the bag mm. okay they look like a chocolate chip cookie, except they are Super square. Thin. And they're thin. They're thin and square. Yeah, I don't think I need all of them. If you've ever made really overbaked cookies, mm -hmm. like really crispy overbaked cookies, that's what that, that's what That's like. exactly what it is like. I wish they had more chocolate though. I would think they're really good. But like Kevin, Kevin said, when like when you bake chocolate chip cookies, and then uh, they're really good fresh out of the oven, but then you let them sit out for a while and they get hard. That's, that's like. exactly what those are like. So they still have the good flavor, but mm -hmm. they're very, very crispy. Yeah, they're not bad. Just I would rather have a softer cookie than a hard cookie. But I can see those uh, going well in ice cream. Yeah. Yeah, or crumble them up and milk. Crumble them up, make a, a like a milkshake, like a blizzard out of them, something like that. All right, these are the brownies, same same thing, same principle basically. These are just chocolate cookies basically. They both have chocolate chips in them. The brownie has chocolate chips as well. The brownie. Tastes just like brownie. It does have brownie. It literally tastes just like brownie. It's weird mm. because I'm used to you know brownies being thicker. Uh, that I really like that. I think, I think I like very the chocolate good. chip ones better. Really? Mm -hmm. I really like that brownie flavor. I think they nailed it. They did a very good job with yeah, those. Yeah, it's the exact same flavor. Mm-hmm. And so you get four of those for 120 calories. It's not bad. No, that's not bad at all. I would have to double that, of course, because. Four of those wouldn't be enough for me. How many servings are in here? Five servings. Yeah. So there's about 20 squares uh, in the bag uh, for $2.98. So, you know, you have to make that decision whether you think that's a good price or not. Uh, you know, keep track of your calories that way, whether it's worth it to you. But, but the flavors, you heard it from Kevin. He likes chocolate chip. I like brownie. So you're just going to have to... Judge for yourself. Judge for yourself by the one that's most interesting to you. Now, I know somebody's going to say, well, you ought to compare these to Mrs. Finster's, or I know there's several brands that have this type of thing out. Um, I think the Finster's are even thinner than that, though. Yeah, right? we probably won't. There's some that are like brownie thins. I had them in my hand. Um, and I thought I would compare them, and then I found these, and I said, no, we won't compare We have so many reviews to do that I doubt we'll get around to comparing them soon. Now, we might later on, months and months down the line, but it won't be anytime soon. So, um, just know these are out there, and they're true to what they say on the bag. They taste just like that. So, uh, I hope you enjoyed the review, and thanks for watching.